a lot of people filing chapter 13 because of mortgage debt. So let's discuss. Hey all my homeowners, this is uh, Josh Sternberg coming at you from sunny Southern California. In this video, I'm gonna talk to you about mortgage debt in a bankruptcy. Mortgage debt in a chapter 13 bankruptcy. The bottom line is if it's your first mortgage, you gotta pay it. If it's your first mortgage, you gotta pay it. You're gonna get very little relief on a first mortgage in bankruptcy court. What it's gonna allow you to do, it's gonna allow you to take the arrears, what you're past due, and pay it out over the plan. So my most common example, your $30,000 in arrears on your first mortgage, you don't wanna lose your house. You file bankruptcy, you take the 30,000, you divide it over 60 months, which is five years, 30,000 divided by 60 months equals $500. Your bankruptcy payment is now $500, plus there'll be some bankruptcy fees, so that's not your final bankruptcy payment, but your mortgage portion, your mortgage arrear portion is $500. So after you file bankruptcy, you have to start paying your monthly mortgage payment, plus an additional $500 to pay back the 30,000. Sometimes people say, I wouldn't file bankruptcy if I was able to make these payments. There's different types of bankruptcies. A chapter 13 bankruptcy is a reorganization. If you wanna keep your home, you gotta make sure you're reorganizing that first mortgage. If you can't afford it, you have to look into other options. There's chapter seven options, loan modification, things of this nature. But a chapter 13, a first deed of trust will have to be paid back during the term of your bankruptcy. Sometimes you will see relief with stripping a second mortgage, okay? We have another video that's called Stripping Your Second Mortgage that you can review and understand. In this video, I just wanted to talk to you guys briefly about first mortgages that you will have to pay back your first mortgage during the life of your bankruptcy if you want to keep your home, okay? I hope that's helpful. Thank you so much.